Hello everyone, my name is the Mad Scorpion, and welcome to another guide on the Still Hunt Exotic Sniper, specifically giving you some extra tips you can use, and the perks that the gun doesn't mention actually are involved with it. Now, if you don't know what the Still Hunt Exotic Sniper is, basically the Golden Gun Sniper, picking up orbs of power or landing six precision shots, will charge the super bar that you can then convert into three Golden Gun shots. Now, these shots aren't magical ones like the super, they do consume ammo, so keep that in mind for later, but a Aside from that, it is typical three shots. The big thing that is of note is, of course, it does interact with Celestial Nighthawk, converting those three shots into one larger, one single shot, which is pretty good just straight off the bat because that means your exotic can, of course, pair in two ways and benefit from another exotic in unforeseen ways. But one that I can already say off the bat that I will show evidence for later is that it does not actually work with Star Eater scales. I did try it. It did not consume the Feast of Light, so it of course doesn't interact with that for bonus damage however there is more things to learn regarding this weapon the first actually being that it does interact with rally banners which is pretty good because right off the bat if you're full ammo no super you can of course have full ammo and all the super and use to start off a damage phase in a big way in case this is your main mode of damage try and take advantage of surges or just have nothing left to go if you want to charge this and then go into a damage phase you can open with golden gun and pop more golden guns depending on how much damage and crits you do hit probably pairs well with divinity but i shall move on to the next recorded clips with some narration for you so you can understand what you are looking at and hear some more details the first and probably most relevant buff is that it actually steals a perk from Golden Gun Hunter, specifically on the Marksman Golden Gun. If you do not know, the Marksman Golden Gun has a nifty part, where if you hit multiple precision shots in a row, it actually increases incremental damage, which you see right here, first shot at 87, 128, and 167. Following that though, I did attempt, Kali did some weird traveling, so I did whiff a shot, but the first shot hits for 79, and the second hits for 115. And I did have a few more clips of me whiffing badly, but I have this longer one right here, which does show a two shot that first one hits, second one misses, but then third one does hit still buffed, but I speed it up a little bit faster and I actually get a full rotation with this in the next set. After wiping out these Scions with a good Gunpowder Gamble and a few Knives, I then charge up the Sniper again, hit the first two shots, both of them hit for 49k, and then hit the Golden Gun with 99, 144, and 189,000 damage, and following up with the Golden Gun to show it is the same Marksman style with the three shots. And just as a precaution, I just equipped the Deadshot Golden Gun right here so you can see. As the Deadshot doesn't have access to the same three-shot damage buff on precision hits, you can see right here when I go Golden Gun mode, it does still carry the 1, 2, 3. And I pop the Deadshot Golden Gun right after to show you I am not on the Marksman. Now, the next clip is one that is also important because that means that Titans and Hunter, or Titans and Warlocks, can also benefit from these same residual perks. Right here, I'm on my Titan with Still Hunt equipped, and I go into the damage phase and hit all the three shots, and they do all still have the Chaining Precision damage buff. And this next clip is a way you can better take advantage of your ammo supply, as when you're shooting it, you can actually activate it from any point and will fully reload the magazine. Not only that, it will actually grant you extra rounds to make sure you can use said golden gun. It doesn't pull three rounds from reserves in addition, it gives you them out of thin air that you can use to make these shots. But, however, again, the next clip actually shows that they did think of Celestial Nighthawk when implementing this, as when you have Celestial Nighthawk on and have the single shot, it does only grant you one extra bullet, not the extra three. So they did actually think about that when giving you Celestial Nighthawk and Still Hunt. Only got one extra from reserves, but did still come with a full magazine refill, so you can dump five shots and almost fully recharge off of Celestial shots. 
Wrapping up this next clip, it's basically just showing the evidence that times five Star Eaters is not used when you pop Golden Gun. Now, any level of Star Eaters would have been used on cast if it was applicable. However, even on cast and after the last shot, it is not consumed, but going Golden Gun does burn it. But with that, that is all I have for you to tell you about this video. I hope I could have been informative and you can better use Still Hunt in any end game or raid scenario you find it applicable. My name is Matt Scorpion. I will see you in the next video.